I believe that when the next global financial crisis happens, it's not going to be just a crash. The next crisis could be the greatest economic depression in modern time. But on the other side of every crisis is opportunity. Here's a 30 second background. The national debt of the US hovers around 21.7 trillion US dollars. There is absolutely no way to pay back all that money. So in order to deal with this immense shortage of cash, the US will need to do two things. First, they will have to borrow an additional $1 trillion per year. Second, they will have to create large amounts of new currency. The big banks like to use a fancy word for creating massive amounts of new currency and that is quantitative easing or QE. The problem is that all this new currency comes from nothing. It's created out of thin air. Poof, that's more debt. And borrowing currency from other countries obviously also creates more debt. An ever-increasing debt is unsustainable and inevitably leads to a crash. Why? Because all this excess currency has created a debt bubble. And debt bubbles pop. And when this debt bubble pops, there's going to be a financial crisis like nothing we've ever seen before. Why? Because the US dollar is the largest bubble we have ever seen in human history. The bigger the bubble, the harder to fall. The coming economic collapse could therefore be an economic apocalypse. But here's the thing, the crash can be withheld and pushed into the future by borrowing and creating even more currency, which is what the banks are doing. They refuse to suffer the hangover and instead keep drinking. But here's the good news, Bitcoin doesn't care about the world economy. Bitcoin is the best expression of money the world has ever seen and Bitcoin will succeed regardless of what any bank or government does. But the coming crash will act as a catalyst for Bitcoin's adoption because the crash will cause widespread disbelief in the current monetary system. And I believe that there will be a stampede to accumulate as much Bitcoin as possible when people realize that fiat is worthless and that wealth cannot be stored in fiat because fiat keeps losing value through the ever increasing creation of more fiat. So they will turn to Bitcoin to preserve their wealth. Why Bitcoin? Because Bitcoin is the hardest money the world has ever seen and people always return to hard money in times of economic crisis. What is hard money? Hard money is a money where it's difficult to create more of that money. Fiat is easy money. By the push of a button, you can create billions of dollars and the banks and the governments do this. Gold is much harder money than fiat. It's expensive and labor intensive to get gold out of the ground. But if gold's purchasing power increase, it would make economic sense to dig up more of it. And so more gold would be added to the supply. And there could be massive amounts of gold in the oceans that could further dilute the supply once we have the technology to dig it up. Bitcoin is much harder money than gold. Here's why. There will never be more than 21 million Bitcoin and they cannot be created at any faster pace than they are. The total supply and the issuance rate is predictable and predetermined. Every four years, the issuance rate of Bitcoin is cut in half. So in the beginning, 50 Bitcoins were created every 10 minutes. Four years later, 25 Bitcoins every 10 minutes. Now we get 12.5 Bitcoins every 10 minutes and so on until we have 21 million Bitcoins, which will be in the year 2140. There is nothing anyone can ever do to either increase the supply or increase the issuance rate. This makes Bitcoin the hardest money that has ever existed. When we have an invention of this magnitude in par with events like the invention of the printing press, the moon landing and the invention of the internet, timing determines impact. If the iPhone had been invented in the 1600s, it simply couldn't have succeeded. And Bitcoin could not have had any better timing. And I say this with confidence for three reasons. First, We've been on the brink of an economic collapse for years, and when the collapse happens, it's going to be a catalyst for Bitcoin adoption. Second, a change in the monetary system is well overdue. Fiat have a 100% failure rate throughout history. All the fiat money that have ever existed have all gone to zero. The dollar, the euro, the Swedish krona are no exceptions. These fiat currencies too are going to zero. And third, Bitcoin is the best expression of money the world has ever seen and the hardest type of money ever created. The future is incredibly exciting. 
more wealth will be created in Bitcoin over the next 10 years than over the prior 10 years. But remember, like any success story, it's not going to be a straight line up. Keep studying, keep believing and just be patient.